guess I'm back. What <laughs> DJ Wolf here again? Um, I just had to talk about this. Just fresh, hot off the presses. Now, let's see here. Hot directly off the presses, guys. I uh was asked about someone. Asked, I mean, just came out right right up front and asked me about giving them a laptop. All right, I'm not shocked by that. What shocked me um, was my nephew uh, sent me a note. Of course, he couldn't just call me and ask me. Uh, he couldn't actually call, which I don't understand. What was with these young people now? They act like they can't call you for anything. They everything got be. They got text every damn thing. All right. So he said, hey, uh, "He said I was wondering." When you had a, a laptop or a MacBook, <laughs> of course, of course, he mentioned that. Like, how did he know? I, got a Mac. I never told him that. Seriously, I have had one for seven years. So I told him straight up. That truck just came out from no freaking way. I was like, where did he come from? He just came out of nowhere. Anyway, so. I told him, I said, never have, I said, uh, I didn't have one that, that, that to give him the internet access. Matter of fact, I, I have one, but if I give it to him, he ain't gonna be able to go on the internet anyway. The only thing he'll be able to do is load applications and music. And he can do that. That's that music, loading music on it wouldn't be no big deal. Which is what I'm gonna keep it for anyway. Because, like, I'm not gonna replace the card. I, I really, I should have took it back when I had a chance and I didn't. I messed around and didn't do it at all. Just because it got warranty on it. Nevertheless, uh, but then he told me, so I got internet in my house. I said, you're right, but the laptop <laughs> I do have for you that I can give you. Wi-Fi don't, don't work that good, and it don't. It work. I tried it again last night. It was just acting up. I'm going to see what it does today because I, 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 well, I thought I ran a couple of fixes on it, and I don't even think it still works. And I was trying to get it to just last long enough where I could download uh, a number of uh, songs to it. Cause it's a big drive. It's a huge drive. Right? That thing got nine. I mean, I think the one I got now has nine, which is almost a ter. It's still almost a terabyte. So I haven't even gone through half. The I haven't gone through a, a sixth of what the hardware is. I'm one. I mean, I'm barely about a seventh or eighth of the hardware into the to hardware. In other words, I only use like maybe 40 gigs so far of the 900 gigs on there. I mean, a thousand of the thousand gigs. On. I mean, the terabyte is on there. And ter terabyte basically is a thousand gigs. So I haven't even used that many gigs on there. No. So I haven't even gotten, I haven't, haven't gotten uh, to a quarter of the way through. And, and already I'm having an issue. But as far as network, everything else on it works fine. It works fine. It's just like, you know, that's the only problem I got. So I told me it wouldn't work that good as far as the the net uh, the, the connector uh, the card a Wi-Fi card. I can always put another one in there for the Ethernet or something similar to it. I thought about that, but you know, so I told him I said, "Why don't you try Amazon? They have laptops for under two hundred dollars." I know if they got a MacBook Pro for three fifty, kind of like what I have. That's which is pretty damn good. Now that mine's like for seven years, hell. You know, he says, "Go check it out." But here's my thing: I don't. Mike, what we talked about earlier about Black Panther, where what kind of stands up for his people. I feel the same way about my people here. You know, I do what I can to be there for, for you know family and for relatives and, and what have you. You know, that's the kind of person I am, but. I'm not going to let you take advantage of me. Now, saying that, um, last year, I gave somebody a used laptop that I had rebuilt, loaded it up, gave them some software, added a few things for it, ran fine, right? Did a complete refresh on it. 
gave it to him. Worked fine for them about a couple of months. It was a fairly new laptop. All of a sudden, they give it right back to him. Oh, we tried going one day, it just it just wouldn't power on. Power apps. Really? And I'm like, no, this is what happened. They had problems with that's what happened. They had a problem with it. I don't know they, who they got to work on. That's exactly what happened. They had got somebody to work on it for them when they had a the problem instead of bringing it back to me. When he got it back to me, the daggone laptop was dead. No power at all. No juice going through. So I don't know what they had the other guy do. <laughs> so I like, hey, you got it for free. Just as simple as that. I gave somebody else a, a desktop one time that I worked on. Just gave it to them. Don't know what they did with me. But gave my mother a, 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 a cheap little small all in one. And it worked great when I had it. She did it. Nah, nah. You know, it's not that it works how I take that back. Hers, it's not that hers that works. She doesn't use it. But it's probably not working good because it's, it's an old machine now. And really, she don't do a lot of stuff on it. I think some some people are... And oh, it was like a couple of times where when I first started doing them computers on the side, I had people say, well, can I get the, uh, can I get the new computer for 60 bucks like that? Uh, <laughs> no. You know, well, what could all come with it? So I explained to him about what all comes with the computer. Like, why well, I wanted to get something to get this on there. I said, okay, well, how much you want to spend to get that? Well, I got a hundred bucks. I was like, uh, you're not going to get all that for a hundred bucks. I mean, you want a good computer. And I told him straight up. You want a good computer that does what you want to do. You got to pay the money. You know, you're just not going to just get it for cheap. You know. And that's what we were talking about before about, you know, what Disney was talking about. Uh, we were talking about asking Disney to pay 25%. <laughs> Please. 25% back to the black communities for, for black communities going to see a movie. Like I said, it's still a stupid narrative to me. One of the most stupid narratives I've ever heard anybody say. Period. You know. And that's what, you know, why I start talking about, you know, we always act like we're a charity case on everything, man. I mean, I mean, to me, it gets old, man. And I've heard several YouTubers talk about this in the past two days. It just gets old as hell. Who the, who the, you know, let me go straight for a minute. I'm sorry, forgive me, Lord. Forgive me, guys. Who the fuck is going to keep doing it every damn time uh, instead of you working for it? And like somebody said, do for self. Now, there was a YouTuber I saw who I'll leave nameless right for right now. So it really pissed me off. Uh, it's going around saying, uh, do for self. How you gonna do for self when you broke? Bitch, I was broke. I was broke 32 years ago, okay? I was 21. I didn't have $100 in my goddamn pocket, okay? And I did the one thing I didn't want to do, but it was a blessed necessity. I joined the military. All right, I swore I wasn't going to fight this man's army. I, I swore I wasn't going to get involved, but I did. That's what I had to do. But it made me a, a better individual. It made me fully aware of of, of, of of why soldiers are soldiers in the first place. And I'm proud to have been, been a soldier for the time I was, and proud to say I'm part of it. You know, best move I ever made. In terms of my career so sometimes you gotta do for something you can't wait for always wait for people to do something for you and that's the real talk that I'm trying to say that same thing goes for everything else you know but I you know I always have people oh, you know uh, I want the latest of this but I can't afford it but well, you knew that when you asked by okay I said you just do it out and save up until you get it that's what I did sure but I also understand nothing comes easy. But you gotta work hard, man. You know, some people don't understand that. Some people still don't understand that. Some older people still don't understand that for some strange reason. And I don't mean much older than me. I'm talking about older, like uh, maybe adults who are a little older, but younger than I am, like in 
their late 40s or something, still trying to go out there hanging out the streets like they're 25. I know people like that too, by the way. They're stupid. You know, real stupid. Real, real stupid? Real stupid. So, but, yeah. Because if you don't do for self, how are you going to do for others? You can never make a claim that you're going to do something for somebody else that you can't do for your own damn self. That's real talk. Can't see it. Can't see it at all. You just can't. traffic is terrible today. All right, guys. Well, I'll be talking more about that. I, I'm not done with that yet. Like I said, uh, more on uh, the correlation of do for self and along with uh, Black Panther. The correlation of doing in relation to Black Panther. All this week on DJ Wolf Live, we're going to be talking about this probably right through next week seeing that I probably won't be able to get to seeing the movie until the weekend because I wanted to go see it today I couldn't go see the day because I had other stuff I had to do I technically can't go see it tomorrow I probably can go see it sometime Friday but maybe I'll, maybe I'll see, sneak over and see it and then tell my wife and buy one no, and then she might beat, beat my ass for going to see it without her but Saturday <laughs> I thought for real Saturday I'm going to see it. I don't care whether you go or not. I ain't going to wait on you. I'm going to see it. All right. All right. Well, hopefully I have my review by then. <laughs> All right, guys. This is DJ Wolf. Maybe I must be tired of something. Maybe I should go home. I should go get some. Oh, God. I should get GT, some GT today, man, but I just don't feel like it. I don't know. Anyway, we'll figure it out. All right, guys. This is DJ Wolf. I'm out.